when you think of deploying an app across multiple geographic locations you should internationalize your app to make users feel at home we can use the flutter localizations and intel package to internationalize our app first of all add the flutter localization and intel package in pubspec.yaml file under dependencies now under the flutter tag add this generate to true now create a new file with this name under this directory now create a class and set all the locals which our app will support here these are the language codes you can find all the language codes here whichever you want in this website now go to the main.dart file and add the supported locals which we have already created now create the l10n yaml file in the root directory inside this add these three lines of code here our first line defines the path of our l10n file where we set our locals inside here this is our template file that we need to add it inside lib directory inside l10n file here app localization is the auto generated file inside dart tool inside flutter gen folder therefore go to this folder and add this file app english this will be our template file in this file assign our key values for each text and assign a description for each key value this file is used for translating our app messages in english language we can add more language files along with this file such as arabic persian and french please note that keys for our text in each locale should be same also we don't need to add description in these files as we have already added in default english template now we should start our app then we can see we have generated different translation files with different languages now in our main file add the import for our generated translations now we need to add these lines inside our material app also add your language local here now in our home page we can use our translation by adding the import of app localization next create the app bar text and access the title translation with this line of code also add some body text here to show the current language we can also pass some parameters to our translations also so for this first we need to add our key value in our default english template like this with the following description and we need to add this key value pair inside other translation files also and in our home page we can add the greetings text here and we can pass the username like this so from our main file we can change the translation just by changing the local here and inside our app you can see our language is changed in app bar and as well as in our body text also you can change the local here from french to persian and you can see the language changes and some layout changes here 